everyone my name is pixel and i want to welcome you to after the curtain call now you know there's a lot of things that go on whenever you're putting on a show act one life is a dream there's a lot of things that go on that whenever you're putting on a show sometimes you have to dream <laughs> that has to be the fastest that we have ever oh god the controls are inverted he lives in the deceit of a king, commanding and governing, and all the praise he receives is written in wind and leaves. So you see, we have things that we have to do behind the scenes the of the of the production. Where, then is the gain of a throne that shall perish and not be known in the other dream that is death. My man, can you stop moving? Dream You're doing a monologue. Rich man of riches and fears, the fears that his riches breed. The poor man dreams of his need and all his sorrows and tears. I really, really wish, though, that these controls were not inverted. He that feigns and foregoes. Seems unnecessary. He that rails on his foes, and in all the world I see, man dreams whatever he be. We, we get, we're getting used to it, though. No man knows. Le like, I even to move left and right, it's inverted. Bound with chains, and I dreamed that these present pains were fortunate ways of old. What is life? What is life? A tale that is told. What is life? What is life? <laughs> let's, let's keep an eye on our buddy here. The greatest good is but small Man, it's, it's real dark. It's real dark in this place. And that dreams themselves are a dream. Let's hope you don't go sprinting across the stage or anything. What is a dream? Mm. Absence of thought? And what is a dream mm. but the life of another? That is only live in the mind. A dream is nothing. I'm starting to wonder what that thing is. I don't understand. What? It is nothing. All these stories are just Why myths, subjective part? ideas, exaggerations, dramatizations. Why did you come? Play we have nothing to give you. We are just I I'm hearing multiple following voices. Following a script. Play your part. Play your part. <laughs> the <Life>. slow clap. <laughs> it's, it's a dream. Life is only a dream. <laughs> ring, ring. Okay, uh, you, you're the electrician, right? You're Me? The one who Spotlight. I, Wait, the I electrician moves the, the spotlight. Go, go behind the stage and <laughs> the radio. The radio. Turn it on. I, I didn't manage to turn it on. Mm. Something might be wrong with it. Please, it's really important. We're depending on you. You're being really suspicious. What? What does the radio have to do with anything? Okay. Turn the radio behind the stage on. Okay. You know, I didn't know the electrician did all kind of things like that, but. You know what? I've never really worked too much in st electricity. Nope. Don't go in there. Search for the key and access to the electricity sources. Well, you know what? First, first we have to turn on this radio in this big open area. Well, found a key. Uh, okay. Radio isn't working. Fix the sounds. Main electricity source. Why is the radio being controlled with a separate room? What is this? Heroes from Oblivion. In each page, a warrior is presented as a dictionary entry. Alexius. Another warrior that went from being flesh and bone to another demigod. As the legend says, a shepherd walking his sheep saw him fall from the sky with a bright light. Alexius passed the time watching the gladiators fight. It was said when the Roman Empire began, Alexius was the best warrior from the abilities he had only learnt by watching others fight. He died during a battle and it was rumored golden blood dripped from his wound. It is known for a fact that he had progeny, but, his where but their whereabouts were lost to time. Alright, Alexius, you, you sound like a cool guy. Uh, hello? Is the, is the key that I picked up not for the electricity? Huh? A good decoration. Can we go in here? No. 
Employ employees only, well, being that I am, there's a lot of, there's a lot of noises coming from places. What could that be? Okay, maybe we had to pass up the radio and go somewhere else? No, this is just the stage, but hey, we've, we've got a book. Our Very White Christmas. A mystical and horrorful Lovecraftian tale about a kid who, misled by his grandfather's indications, awakes an elder being while making a snowman. A Christmas classic for the whole family that I myself would recommend. Oh, would you? Would you recommend a book about an eldritch snowman god? Yeah, you know what? I'd do it too. You know what? I, I can't, uh, I can't really say much about that. Okay, we we picked up this key, but we still can't open that door. Oh, lighting. Oh, look, a paper. Today's the day. This is the day we risk it all. Mr. and Mrs. Lewis, famous drama passionates, they are coming to see our play at the Goldshine Theatre. The Lewises. Their family has supported small acting companies since time immemorial. And today is our turn. Th that is if everything turns out fine, of course. I have been practicing theater since I was six years old. Started from a young age. Leg wreckers will rise to the top. Leg wreckers. I'm, I'm getting nervous. <laughs> is it too obvious? Maybe I should stop writing notes and continue practicing the script. I, I hope it goes well. Let's break a leg. <laughs> you, you should have written in the, s the snap that you, that you did. Uh, okay, so again, uh, how did I pass that up? <laughs> what the hell? What the hell was a giant tentacle? I didn't, I didn't know this was an anime game. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, guys. I did not know that that was this type of game. All right, electricity. What is this? Oh God, what? <laughs> what in the world is this? What is this? <laughs> I don't understand that. I, I don't. The tenth sister will hatch. Oh, ch chickens? Is that, is that have something to do with chickens? What in the world is up with these games? Oh! I see now. Okay. I have to connect these. Ah. I get it now. Okay, so that means... Yep. Alright, we, we figured it out, guys. Search for the key and access to the electricity sources. We grab the electricity key. Hey, look, another book. The Fall of the Mayans with a big bug on it. This piece tells the story of the Mayans who ended up being eradicated by the Aztecs in a cruel and painful way. Because of this, their souls wouldn't be transformed into butterflies as their religion demanded since they didn't reach the sun. They instead became their counterparts, moths, living in the dark and forever searching sun's light. An interesting and dramatic fantasy book. That is a nice... That's a nice metaphor. Is it even possible that the Lewis have criticized mm. our play as excellent? Mm. No. Even better. Is it even possible they have bought us the whole Goldshine Theater? I'm shocked. The Goldshine is now ours. I never would have seen it coming. Besides the theater... They have also bought us some decorations, which Helena is organizing, and some extra pounds Jeffrey has spent on books to write an original play. I always wanted to do that. Now, if Jeff wasn't a mess and didn't throw his books around everywhere, I'm sure they're lying around here somewhere. It, okay, so is that all the books that we've been picking up? Is that what you're telling me? And what is this big metal door... What's the metal door that apparently we opened? Is it is it that one right there? Like, did I even need to... Can we jump down? No, we can't jump down. No shortcuts. 
Can't take no shortcuts in the theater. We've got to take the stairs like everyone else. All right, this sounds. Oh, lovely. We've got some, got some wires in the ground. We've got another book, The Pied Piper of Hamelin. The classic story of Pied Piper of Hamelin. However, in this book in specific, it is noted that the flute is not what attracted the invasive rats, but that the flute summoned some creature which was itself the reason of the rats escaping away. The book calls this creature Schlagergeist. The book is really, really old. Could it be the original? You know what? It might be. It might be the original. Alright, we got some little electricity puzzles. Life is dream. You know what? I, I didn't really see that at first, but you know what? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Life is dream. And now we've got to go turn on the radio. Thankfully, we know where that's at. That's right here. I wonder I wonder what the radio is going to tell us. It's going to be cryptic message. Oh, good. It's white noise. What is that? Is something happening? Mission hide? Am I hiding back here? I hope I'm hiding. Hello, motherfucker. Ah! <laughs> That was not a good hiding spot. The monster found us. Okay, I guess we gotta find... Mission, exit the electricity room. Okay, I guess we were supposed to get caught. That's, uh... That's the only thing I can think of. Is that we were supposed to get caught there. And why did I need electricity... To move a move a uh, a square, a, a panel, yeah, a panel. That's the word I'm looking for. Okay, so maybe we were supposed to get caught. That's that's all I can think of, <laughs> because there really wasn't anywhere for me to hide. You know what? I couldn't go behind the curtain or anything. But uh, I mean. You know what? If this is what it takes to advance the story, then so be it. I hope there's another spot for us to find another book. Oh no! We got jumped! It knew we were escaping! Oh wow. Thanks for playing. You should complete it after the curtain call. Act 1. Did you find all the books to play the intramies? Extra content? Did you find the Act 2 Wink Easter Egg? Support and share the game for Act 2. Aww! You mean to tell me that we missed a book? No, hold on. Hold on, we, we gotta go back through this. We need to find all five books. And I'm almost positive it's in this decoration door. Because that's the only door that we didn't go in. So, I'm gonna go back through this again. We're gonna get to that fifth book. And I will be right back. All right, you guys, so we went through a couple times, actually. We found all five books. We have now unlocked the extra content down here, the Angela Mez 1. So let's see what this extra content has in store for us. Okay, so they've, they've got us starting off in the vents this time. So are we sneaking back into the theater? After escaping, after getting ambushed by our friend, oh, which by the way, are we the tenth sister? For our hearts beat and our steps sound at the rhythm of your music, we'll be your voice, we'll be your body, till your divine body meets the sky once again. We will serve under your light. Amen. The stage is not merely the meeting place of all arts, but is also the return of art to life. You talk too much. Well, isn't that a bit rude? You ever gonna tell the person that they talk too much? Hey, hey, squid boy. 
Uh, how we doing today? Hey, I, I saw your tentacle earlier. <laughs> Hope you didn't mind that. Oh, goodness, more. More electrical puzzles. Nope, that's not it. I think, I think we gotta start from the bottom here. Yep. That's what we have to do. And then we go around here, get that one, and there. Boom. Beautiful. We are, we are the kings. Oh, hey. We, we did that puzzle to light this up so we can get to the next door. Ugh. Inky. Let me just step around your little ink pile right here. Hope you don't mind. Why is life a dream? I don't know. Why is life a dream? I, I figure you could answer that for it. You know we're stepping through it this time. Uh-oh. Somebody made a mess. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? <laughs> I Play your parts. That's what we say. Play your parts. That's it. We got those extra books so that we could get grabbed by a giant squid monster. <laughs> Fantastic. Loved it. I loved the story that this game told. And they even did it in a whole theater play setting. They actually went through they even gave us a performance at the beginning of it loved it fantastic i cannot wait for act two of this to come out but if we keeping an eye on it we will definitely be playing that later on when it comes out thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed what you saw feel free to like the video you want to see more content like this get notified whenever other stuff i do comes out subscribe to the channel you want to play this game for yourself i'll have a link down in the description below Go check it out. Play it with all of us. Thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye now.